like the eagle watching the direction of the wind and then it spreads its wings that's what we call soaring it does not fly the eagle soars the flesh the flesh oh whoever told you that it is only satan you have to fight the flesh let me tell you something about the flesh in my opinion of all these three evils this is the most vicious of them because you can cast evil spirits you can run away from wicked and unreasonable men but this flesh you see it remains with you and the bible says to crucify it and you will die daily the flesh <laughs> romans 7 from verse 18 for i know that in me again our paul is speaking now that is in my flesh dwelleth no good thing for to will is present with me he says but how to perform that which is good i find not let's continue it says for the good that i would that i would i do not but the evil which i would not want to do that is what i do verse 8 20 let's continue it says now if i do that which i would not it is no more i that do it but sin that dwelleth in me 21 it says i find then a law that when i would do good evil is present with me 22 for i delight in the law of god sincerely in the inward man are you seeing the conflict now but i see another law in my members warring against the law of my mind and bringing me into captivity to the law of sin which is in my members 24. it says "O oh, wretched man that i am an apostle that casted demons without talking twice is now expressing frustration what kind of an enemy is this that you cannot cast out with one word oh, wretched man that I am he says who shall deliver me Paul is crying is there someone who can deliver me from this body of death listen the flesh is so vicious in its operation that it reveals itself in levels according to your growth there are many times that the flesh will lie low for many years and you would flatter yourself into thinking you have attained unto liberty without pressing in the spirit. It is simply because certain doors have not been opened. If you are not a king, you have no business with Bathsheba. Are we together now? Yes. If you are not Samson the warrior, you have no problem with Delilah. No. Are we together now? If you are not Abraham, the one who should be the father of nations, you have no problem with the frustration of barrenness that will lead to the birth of Ishmael. Let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, please hear me. As you rise, your flesh has a way of reinventing strategies that is able to attack and challenge you at the level of your growth. There are some temptations that will never come to your life when you are broke. It's not that you are delivered from them. The temptation cannot work because what it feeds on to get to you is not even there. Are we together now? Please listen very carefully. If you have not been given an appointment in an office where there is a cash flow of one billion naira every week, the, you will think that you have immunity against bribery and corruption. And you may even have the audacity to write a book about those who are doing it. This is why the older men become, the more silent they become. Because there is something they learn with time. That this life bar, at the end of it all, it is God. Is someone learning? Now you will understand why Jesus said in your prayer, do not forget to bring this. Deliver us from evil. Hallelujah. Why will there be an attack over your car when there is no car there? I'm not being sarcastic now. Are we together now? Yes. There are many believers today who believe that they have attained unto a spiritual state that has magically immune them from certain things. No. 
the flesh is lying low quietly allowing you do you know now let me speak a bit of biology it is said a woman from age 12 or 13 or so has the potential to give birth but a woman can stand even at age 40 and her womb is there and you will never see pregnancy because the condition that allows that pregnancy has not yet been engaged is that true as soon as that woman takes in seed immediately you will see that that quiet that that pregnancy that has the potential for it had always been there same thing happens with a man this is how the flesh is there is something the flesh is waiting for to activate it, operation. And the unemployment issue has helped the flesh to lie quiet. So you can believe that I am fine and I am free. Are we together? There is a certain level of increase and influence that if it has not yet come. Oh Jesus, for as long as you are still a baby, even though you are the word incarnate, no problem. But as long as the news of your arrival got to Herod, Herod said, who did you say? Go and search the archives for me. Is there such and such a prophecy? He said, let me know where that child is so that I will come. Do you know that because of the arrival of Jesus, many women lost their children? Does that look like a savior? What kind of a savior whose arrival makes the death of, there was a lamentation in Rama. Many people died because a gift that will save the world arrived whoever told you that good things don't create conflict whoever told you that the arrival of glorious things will not bring contention from hell are we together now yes this is a very powerful teaching jesus arrives if you were the woman who lost your child would you want to see jesus and they told you prophetically that this is the savior you want to save my life and you killed my child by your arrival. What a savior. How about Mary? The moment it was announced in the spirit, Hail Mary, that salutation came and he said, you are favored. The next thing that followed her life was trouble and controversy. She was about to lose Joseph. Are we together? And then the scribes and the Pharisees came, just confess, who is the father of this child? A ghost. You must be stupid. You are playing with our intelligence on top of the fact that you have brought shame to your husband and our family. I'm an innocent young virgin. We do not believe that. Ladies and gentlemen, open doors come with challenges. That is the reason why men must be prepared to attain stature in the spirit. There are many doors that it is God that closed by himself. Because you have been weighed in the spirit. And God has seen that if that door is open, the, left, the bankruptcy of spiritual intelligence and stamina, you will die because a door opened. So he will close the door as an act of his mercy. And quickly send you to men and women who would midwife your growth until you attain stature in the spirit. And then that door will be opened. I plead the blood, I plead the blood, I plead the blood. I plead the blood, I plead the blood, the precious blood. I plead the blood, the blood, eternal saving blood. I don't have to cry. Yes, I plead the blood, I plead the blood, I plead the blood. I plead the blood, I plead the blood, the precious blood. I plead the blood, the blood, eternal saving blood. I don't have to cry. your mouth and declare Satan the Lord rebuke you I come by the authority of the king and priest in the name of Jesus Christ the Lord rebuke you I invoke the power of Elohim I rebuke you over my life over my health someone pray the Lord rebuke you the Lord rebuke you. The Lord rebuke you. The covenant of the God of David fights you. 
in the name of Jesus, I call upon the holder of the key of David that opens a door that no man can shut and shut a door that no man can open. He has opened the door. No man can shut it. Go ahead and declare. He has opened the door. No man can shut it. Speak over your ministry. Speak over your family. Satan, thus far have you come. No further shall you go. The Lord is against you. In the name of Jesus. The Lord is against you. Gentlemen, please hear me. Please hear me. Listen. Listen. Many of you will run sometimes this year and come and listen to this message again. Because the prophecy for open doors is not complete until there is a training to know how to become a person of stature. You need the door to remain open for those behind you to come. There are giants on every mountain. That is why you are a warrior. He said, I have fought a good fight. I have kept the race. You are not only a runner. When you are in the field, dress like an athlete, but you are in the battleground, don't wear athletic clothes. You have to carry the regalia of a warrior. You are both a warrior, you are an athlete, and you are a keeper. 